Hey, what's up, y'all? Today, we're gonna be talking about uh, the five things that I wish I knew before starting PA school. So we all know that PA school is difficult. Um, the time before you start PA school is, is really unique because honestly, you know you're gonna be in this program for two to three years. You have no idea what you're getting yourself into. You just know it's gonna be difficult. So here are five things that I wish I knew before I actually started PA school. First thing is uh, you will not study every single day. This is what I thought going into PA school. I thought, oh my gosh, my life is over. I'm not gonna see my friends or family for two and a half years because I'm gonna be in class or studying every minute of every single day. It's simply not true. Especially for me being in a two and a half year program, I can't speak to the programs that are 24 months long. But for me, um, I spent many evenings in didactic to uh, just watching TV, watching Netflix, hanging out with my wife, uh, hanging out with our dog. I did not study every night of every single day. Now I did stay on top of the harder classes. Uh, I was proactive uh, in that regard. I probably studied an hour or so a night, um, depending on what kind of material we were covering. But like the easier classes, I could put those off and study for those um, a little closer to the exam. So it's not like you're studying every second of every hour of every day. Number two. Your first semester of school is gonna be your hardest semester. And it's not necessarily because the material is super hard. It is challenging, but it's not impossible. I think the hardest part about your first semester is that everything is new. Um, you could potentially be in a new state, in a new city. You're with all these classmates who you hardly know. Um, all these new faces, new faculty. You have this big schedule. Um, new stuff to keep track of. It's just a lot at one time. And you can expect your first few weeks to kind of be a little chaotic until you find your routine and your groove and until you figure out how you gel with all this new, new uh, material and deadlines and things coming at you. So I would say be patient in your first few weeks of PA school. Uh, they're gonna be hard, but it's not permanent. You're gonna figure out what works best for you and you're gonna you're gonna kill your last or your next like six or seven eight semesters whatever it is you're gonna be just fine. Number three, grades don't matter. I'm gonna say it again, grades don't matter. I knew this going into PA school, but I still focused on grades. Why? Because I have a group of friends, and we're very competitive. We're all guys. We hang out all the time. We're super competitive and super prideful. So we try to get A's in every class. And I would say most of us to this day are have still straight A's through PA school. Um, you don't have to be that way. It is additional stress on you. It's not necessary. You can get by in PA school with plenty of B's. It's gonna be okay. The biggest thing is that you pass your boards. You pass the pants. That is the biggest and most important thing. And grades don't matter. Grades, you could, you could be the worst student in didactic, but you get on rotations and just know how to communicate with patients and be able to apply things that you read in a book so much better than someone who's a straight A student. So just know that, know that grades don't matter. No one is gonna ask you what your grades were in PA school whenever you're looking for a job. It just doesn't matter. So that's super important. Number four, your class will become your family. And this is really, really good. Uh, your classmates, you're gonna hang out with them all the time. You're gonna study with them, you're gonna go to the bar with them, you're gonna go to movies with them, you're gonna go to all kinds of things with them. You're gonna know everything about them, their medical history, whenever you start practicing histories and physicals, uh, you're gonna just learn a lot about them. You're gonna spend so much time with them and they literally become your family. Um, I, my, my close group of guy friends, they were all invited to, to my wedding in uh, last October. So that's just an example of how close you become with everyone. And it helps so much that you're all going through this stressful time in life together. All right, the last thing I wish I knew before starting PA school is that your faculty and your program are a tremendous resource. And they care so much about you and your success. It is not like undergrad to where you're taking these biology and chemistry courses that uh, are trying to weed you out and trying to make you fail. In PA school, the faculty want to see you succeed. Uh, they are always available to talk to you about anything. It doesn't even have to be academic related. 
Um, if you have family issues going on, if there are things in your personal life that you want to talk to someone about, trust me, your faculty members, the people in your program would be more than happy to speak with you. And I know that I, that's my experience in my PA program. My faculty are super approachable. They all have an open door policy. Um, they all want to see you succeed. This concludes another video. I hope this was uh, beneficial to you all. I hope maybe I can calm some nerves before starting PA school. I know it's a stressful time in life. Um, if your program starts the next few months, right now the best thing you can do is relax. Don't go out and hit a bunch of books and study because honestly, you're gonna learn everything you need to know in PA school. That's why you're paying the money to be in a PA program. They're gonna teach you everything you need to know. And if you sit down and start studying right now, it's either gonna be the wrong stuff you're studying or it's not gonna be to the, to the depth of the level of knowledge that you need to know for PA school. So take a deep breath, relax. You're in an awesome field. You're gonna love the next few years of your life. You're gonna learn a ton. Um, just yeah, enjoy life right now before it gets crazy. So thank you all for watching. Uh, like and subscribe if you haven't and have a great day.